feel from my heart I want the world to know How Jesus loves me so Hello there, friends! <laughs> hey, what's up? I like that. Hey, why don't you turn to your neighbor and say, What's up? Turn to your other neighbor and say, What's up? Cool. Hey, well, boys and girls, today we're going to be learning about how to be a good friend. Now, a friend is someone that you like or that you do things with or that you play with. Mm -hmm. And you know what? I want to be a good friend. Do you want to be a good friend? Hey, if you want to be a good friend, when I count to three, I want you to yell, oh yeah! Can you do that? All right, are you ready? Okay, ready? One, two, three. Oh, yeah! Hey, well, I need to find my friend, Little K. Now, I haven't seen him. Have you seen him? Look behind you. There he is. There he is! Oh, there's my friend. Hey, let's go say hi to Little K. Come on. <laughs> there you are. Hey, Little K. Let's all wave hi to Little K. Hey, friend, how are you? Yeah, well, it's a great day today. And boys and girls, we're going to be talking about being a friend. Yeah. Hey, but before we do, I think it's time for some singing. Are you guys ready for some singing? Well, all right, let's everybody stand up. Come on, you guys, let's all stand up, because we're going to sing. Here we go. Yeah, yeah. I know someone who makes me happy I know someone who makes me dance He's the reason my feet are moving He's the reason I'm gonna lift my hands and clap Clap, clap to the sound Jump, yeah. jump up and down Spin, spin, spin all around I'm singing
Sit down. Everybody sit down. Are we all sitting? Great. Well, you know, we are discovering how we can be a good friend. And I think it's time we do some discovering right now. Hey, little K, can you help us? All right. Well, why don't you please fly up and get our discovery map so we can discover what we are discovering today. Okay. Hey, boys and girls, here it is. It's our discovery map. Let's take a look. Hmm. What does this look like? I think I've seen one of these before. Yeah. It's gray and it looks like it's made out of metal. And it looks like they're little round circles that are connected to each other. Have you seen one of these before? What do you think it is? It's a chain. Yeah. Did you say chain? I think it's a chain. Well, boys and girls, we need to discover what a chain and being a friend have to do with one another. And I know who can help us. Yeah, Professor Sock. Let's go say hi to him. Come on. Hey, Professor. Oh, hey, Kai. Hi, Professor Sock. You know, Professor, we're learning about being a friend. And today, we have what looks like a, a chain. Oh! So we were wondering what a chain and being a friend have to do with one another. Can you help us? Chains! Hmm. Well, I really don't know what chains and being a good friend have to do with one another. Let's go visit the Soxatron to find out more. There it is, in all its glory, the Soxatron. Let's take a look. Oh, we're working on the Soxatron, discover what we can. Working 
give up the socks and shun. <gasps> There's your answer, man. That's it. The chains remind us of a story in the Bible about a man named Peter. Now, Peter was put in jail with chains on his hands and feet. But Peter's friends prayed for him while he was in jail. And that's what friends do. They pray for each other. Brilliant! <laughs> Thanks, Professor! You got it, bud! Well, boys and girls, Peter's friends prayed for him when he was in chains and in prison. And today, we're going to discover the amazing thing God did because Peter's friends prayed for him. Hey, you hear that? Whoa, hey, everybody get up. Come on, everybody stand up on your feet because it's time for our Remember Burst. All right, boys and girls, are we all standing up? Are we standing? Good, because today's Remember Verse comes from Proverbs 17, 17. Proverbs 17, 17 in the Bible, all right? And this is how it goes, all right? I'll do it first, and then you can do it with me, and we'll do it together, okay? Here it goes. A friend loves at all times. Let's all try that together, okay? First it goes, a friend. So we're kind of shaking hands with our friend. Yeah. So a friend loves. Yeah, you can do love, can't you? Loves at all. And put our hands out all, 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 all times. And you can tap your watch. What? Can we do that from the beginning? All right, everybody, let's get ready. Say it proud and loud. Here we go. Proverbs 17, 17. A friend, shake hands with your friend. A friend loves at all times. Let's do it from the beginning. Everybody, here we go. A friend loves a hug, at all times. That's how a friend should be. I think we should try it one more time. Really now, okay? Here we go, friends. Ready? A friend loves at all times. Yeah. How'd you do? Did you do good? <laughs> all right. Well, boys and girls, you can all sit down. Great job. Everyone, let's all sit down. Good. Hey there, boys and girls. Welcome to the Bible Box. Yeah, that means it's time for our Bible adventure. Our Bible story for the day. Hey, do you see something? Hey, what's little K doing? He's bouncing. Yeah. That means it's time to find the key that unlocks the chest. Little K loves to find the key. And you know how he loves to find it? By bouncing. Do you like to bounce? Me too. I have an idea. Hey, why don't we all help little K bounce and find the key together? All right, boys and girls, everybody stand up. Come on, boys and girls, stand up, because we're going to all bounce together and help little K find that key. All right? Are we all up? Are we up? All right, wait for the music, and let's bounce. Here we go. <laughs> Good job, little K. Boys and girls, it's the key. All right, now. Let's all sit down. Everybody, let's sit down. Let's all sit down. Because we have a very important job to do. We're all going to unlock the chest, all right? So, come on. All right, boys and girls, it's time for our special job. Let's see your key. Hold your key up. Now, boys and girls, we're going to put the key in the lock. Are you ready? Here we go. Let's turn the key. Oh, 
Hey, it's our doodad for the day. Yeah. Now, boys and girls, what does that look like? Looks like a chain, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, boys and girls, in our Bible adventure today, there's going to be a chain, so you look for it, okay? So, boys and girls, when we see the doodad, we need to do something, don't we? Yeah. Hey, since we're talking about a chain, let's make our own little chain, okay? Let's make a circle, make another circle, and then let's put them together like this. Can you do that? Let's make a circle, another circle, and let's make a chain, all right? And then let's put our hands on our lap, all right? Good. Now, boys and girls, our Bible adventure is about Peter and the amazing thing that happened to him because his friends prayed for him. Let's go! Hey, there's Peter. Peter was one of Jesus' friends. Peter would travel all around helping other people to learn about Jesus. Lots of people listened to Peter, and they were happy to hear about Jesus. Peter was sharing good news, and that made people happy. But there was one mean man who wasn't happy at all. He was the king. And the king did not like anyone who followed Jesus. And since Peter loved Jesus and spread the good news about him, the mean king said, I don't like what Peter is doing. Guards, throw him into jail. So Peter was put in jail. And the guards put chains on his hands and his feet. Do you see the doodad? Do you remember what to do? Then the guard sat outside the jail so he couldn't leave. Poor Peter sat in jail, all chained up, and he was alone. Now Peter had some friends who loved him very much, and because they loved him, they all got together and prayed for Peter. And they prayed, and they prayed, and they prayed. The friends prayed all day and all night. Then something amazing happened. While Peter was sleeping in jail, an angel suddenly appeared and told Peter, Quick, get up and follow me. And the chains fell right off of Peter while the guards just kept sleeping. Wow! How neat! And they walked right by all of those big, mean, and sleeping guards. Peter's friends prayed for him. And they prayed for him because they loved him. And that's what good friends do. So, boys and girls, did you find the doodad? Yeah. Hey, what was it? It was a chain, wasn't it? Yeah, and that chain reminds us of the story of how Peter's friends prayed for him. And because they prayed for him, Peter was freed from chains in prison. How cool is that? Friends pray for each other, don't they? Hey, well, boys and girls, it's time to find out how much you remember from our Bible adventure, all right? Because, boys and girls, it's time for Knock. Knock. Knock, knock. Who's there? This was our doodad for the day. Peter had these on him when he was in prison. What is it? A chain. Knock, knock. Who's there? I came and helped Peter because his friends prayed. I walked out of the prison with Peter, and then I was gone. Who am I? The angel. Knock, knock. Who's there? We all loved Peter a lot. When Peter was in jail, we all got together and we prayed for him. Who are we? 
We're Peter's friends. Knock, knock. Who's there? I didn't like anyone who taught people about Jesus. I threw Peter in jail because he taught people about Jesus. Who am I? The Great King. Knock, knock. Who's there? I told people about God's love. I was thrown into prison and put in chains. Who am I? Peter. Knock, knock. Who's there? Knock, knock. Who's there? Tank. Tank who? You're welcome. Oh, yeah! So, boys and girls, what did we learn today? We learned that friends pray for each other. Praying is talking to God. Hey, can you think of a friend that you can pray for? I bet you can. Hey, since you're my friend, I would like to pray for you, okay? So, hey, let's all put our hands together, and I'm going to pray for you, okay? Let's do that. Close your eyes. Dear Lord, thank you for my friend, and I pray that you would help them to pray for their friend. And I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, friend. I prayed for you. All right, people. That's all we got for you today. So we'll see you next time, okay? And you pray for your friends, all right? Bye, guys. See ya. Bye. Bye.